Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me. This is GGF bringing you episode 25, halfway to 50, <laughs> of Let's Try Shadow Empire with the Oceania DLC. And of course, we're doing an Oceania DLC map. So let's get right into it. Hope you guys are well and ready to check out some more of this fascinating game with me. We're trying to crack the code here of logistics, and I think traffic signs will definitely help because we've made a few mistakes, it looks like, in terms of our logistic points. Let's look at um, current ones. Okay. So right here, immediately, we want to put a traffic sign. Um, let's see how we could do this. Put all right there. Lock all points here. So will that show up? I don't know if that made the change. So they're not going to go down there anymore. A lot are coming down this side. Um, let's see, we've blocked that. I'm going to go ahead and put a traffic sign right here blocking this road. Simple enough. So you can see our traffic sign there. And do we have to put one here? No. And that should definitely make a big difference. Just putting those two signs up. We've got roads. Okay, they're going on a bit of offensive now. It's kind of a cat and mouse game thus far with Mothram and our invasion. Um, but this, I think, should be a good start. We're pushing a lot of points here and down on this road. Um, not sure where that branch is red. Is that supposedly a bottle mark right there? I don't get that. Anyway, I think we should be good now. Um... We want to block this road. So they don't come down this way before that gets built. And Tredion, that's getting built. 0.6 turns left. There's 62 industrial points. Okay. All right, let's go to move. Did we move everybody or no? Do we have a new turn? No. Um, looks like we did move everybody, right? Can't really do anything there. These guys have some movement. Um. Pick up process tunnel, but these guys don't have enough fuel and stuff. These guys are going to be hopeless against a 
those units, so I don't know what to do against them. Alright, so... Decisions. Create custom formation type. Ooh. Sir, we would like you to choose a formation type you want to customize. Keep in mind this will add a new formation type. The original used for customization will be kept as it is. We have 80 customization points available. Wow, 3200 to make a motorized light infantry brigade. Um... Motorized infantry battalion. of independent motorized infantry battalion but also independent motorized infantry regiment and division motorized M -tree mg battalion oh that's not motorbike right okay um Well, a new formation type. These aren't really. Are these new? I guess so. Motorized infantry. Sir, how are we going to customize independent motorized infantry battalion? Note that the bigger variants of these formation type will be adjusted in the same fashion. Also note that you cannot change or remove the truck's APCs. They'll be automatically adjusted based on your changes. Current battalion sized order of battle. 1000 infantry, 1000 motorized transport and reinforcement type. Hang on, that's what I think I want to do, but if we come here and raise formation, Independent Motorized Infantry Battalion. We can already make that. By the way, we have a pretty good jump on, like, some of this, but we can already make that Regiment and Division. So I'm not sure... Battalion. We have that. Oh, choose a formation type you want to customize. So if we customize the motorized infantry battle, let's see, independent infantry battalion. Add a reinforcement type. Enforcement type. I'm not sure though. And recon, it's just how we would like to customize them. Um, yeah, let's go with the motorized and see what it add. Right, we can add a machine gun or a buggy. Oh. To independent motorized infantry battalion. Now, what if we go to independent infantry battalion? We can add a buggy to the independent infantry battalion. But that means that we can never make a normal one again, kind of, I think. Or no, this makes it add a new formation type. So this could be pretty good to get some... But if I look at the buggies, hold on a second. If we go to manage, type, 
recon buggy. It's a Cooper Plus. Let's see if there's anything. This is a recon buggy. Its main armament is a machine gun and it's been issued minimal 5mm steel plating with a medium diesel engine. It has a highly overpowered engine. Field testing. Okay. It does take a lot of fuel per hex. Size of four to group in with the tank. Quality none. Recon of seven. It is cheap, it is small, it can easily be given an overpowered motor, and on top of that, it has a machine gun. Furthermore, it has excellent recon capabilities. Use buggies as scouts or for harassing enemy soft targets. Keep them away from enemy tanks. Soft targets. I'm not sure exactly what soft versus hard means in this case. Um, wow, base design is very nice. 91. Structural design, 102. That's pretty average. firepower uh, well let's see if we were to make this a new formation what difference would it be from the well we can't Okay, so it would be different. It'd be a recon type, independent recon battalion. So for independent, let's change the independent recon battalion and add infantry. How many infantry are we adding? 300. Okay. The current names for this new custom formation Type R Independent Recon 2 Battalion Regiment Division. Uh, finish. The new customized formation type Independent Recon 2 is now available for immediate deployment, sir. Ah, there it is. 50 buggy, 300 infantry. And if we make a division, 600 buggy, 3600. Very cool. Could be something to check out. All right. A representative of the Scotty Waters Maritime Trade House, House visits us to propose us a regular line of communications with them. Setting things up will cost us some credits, however. The MTH requires that we make pay for part of the liaisons as well. Do we accept? Yes. Commerce plus two, one political point, 200 credits. The more options we have, the better. Scotty Waters Maritime Trade House is happy to hear so. Quickly after you have notified the representative, you see more ships appearing on the horizon. And sloops dropping off more maritime traders on your beaches. The little embassy is in construction. Note that from next round onwards, you'll have stratagems available to communicate. Nice. Charlie Blacksite, Staff Council, plus two. Rico Hardy, Advisor, plus one. Buzz Beat Day, Air Force Research, minus four. Chet Gorgonet. Nea, Foreign Affairs plus one, Xeno Krypton Love, Secret Service plus two, and Commerce plus two. Dezao Domain remain, re demands release of spy. We have unmasked and un imprisoned a Dezao Domain spy. Their diplomats have offered us nine political points in exchange for his release. Should we accept to release the spy? Ah, oh, meritocracy though. That's killing me. That's going to put meritocracy in the lead. But um, I mean, a lot to us if you would release this particular spy. Yeah, I think we'll return their spy and refuse their payment. That gives a relation increase, or we could just accept their offer for mind plus three. 
We do have a good mind profile. Well, it's at 42. At 50, we get cultural adjustment bonus and fluid defense stratagem, curiosity. And that would only add six to meritocracy, which still takes it over 50, which would give us capable supervisors per 1,000 population of workers, plus one food and stratagem grand convention. Okay, so we will, in heart, almost a 70, which would be rallying flag, morale bonus plus 60%, stratagem charge, unit feet, flag bearer. This would get us very close to that, but this would get us closer to curiosity, mind, to note to people that are cerebral and that like to think, have some morals, and be creative. We'll accept it and take their nine political points. Except our Dezel domain grudgingly paid up when we released their spy. Tank Sideway, Interior Council plus three, Xeno Krypton Love, Secret Service plus one, Mind plus three, Meritocracy plus six. And now Meritocracy is in the lead here as our main. One new commander for first mil machine gun infantry brigade. First infantry MG first MG infantry brigade is without leadership. We need to appoint a commander as soon as possible. Which candidate commander can count on your blessing? Charlize Alain. She's twenty three years old. Justice Knights member. Escape artist. Uncanny ability to make their troops disappear from the battle thing field when things turn sour. Used in retreat checks. We do that a lot, so that's pretty good to have. She doesn't really have much of anything. War 34 is good. Cap of 2, Meritocracy, Heart. Um, then we've got Trina Bennett, who we're not on great relations with. Cap of 1. She's got Streetwise and Sixth Sense and Improvisation. Lawful League member, Autocracy. Ishmael Porthos, Covert Ops, High Command, Diplomacy, plus 20 Bribery, plus 20 Intimidate. Wow, what's all this? Corporate Board Member, seat on the Corporate Board, although that's right. Charisma plus 10, Luxurious Lifestyle, has a tendency to indulge him or herself in private parties and expensive luxury purchases. Bribery plus 20, corporate shareholder, owns part of the corporation, intelligence plus 10, decadent lifestyle, does not only like luxury, there's a tendency to go overboard and abandon all decency and morality in his or her escapades, intimidate plus 20, corporate CFO, chief financial officer of the corporation, charisma and intelligence plus 10, why is he not getting the bonuses here though? Plus 16, agriculture, and corporate expert team has taken the corporate expert team in his retinue, charisma plus five, intelligence plus five. Um, she's a little more suitable. She's all about that autocracy. Awful league member. Quite authoritative, natural authority, the leader has, less submissive. More chance to follow their own profile rather than the regime profile. These guys are justice, she's a justice knights member, which I'd rather have on our good side, but she's very green. Maybe we could go to strategy and do a uh, 
true civilian. Aye, aye, sir. Success. A new leader has been added to the reserve pool. Nathaniel Tomlin. Cap of two. Good oratory skills. A little bit of leadership. Investigation and administration. 37 years old. Ah, militia. Democracy enforcement. Not bad. Leader is unaligned. That's who I want to lead. So we're going to have to dismiss... Charlize Alaline. Copy that. No, sir. We've asked the nomination committee for a different candidate than Charlize. This caused a loss of four relation points with the Justice Knights. Oh, no. Nathaniel Tomlin. Let's just appoint him. Understood. Honored with the trust, sir. I'll strive to make the first MG Infantry Brigade the best unit around. Relation improved 10. That's all of those moves. Um... So let's see, did we do a new turn? Right, we are on move. No, we're still on this last turn. Let's see how long we've been playing. 21 minutes only, wow. Okay, um... I don't want them attacking the buggy, so we're gonna come right here. If they come and attack the buggy, we'll be ready. So, all right, it looks like it's time to turn the page, maybe sixty two industrial points. I wonder if we can add this militia, this rifle militia, to this crew here. Let's try to do that next turn. Um, oh, the reason it says 0% sometimes is because I'm clicking around here when I should be on SHQ. 19% to raise that. The operational headquarters, it's... Oh, that's army. So we could actually make like almost a core, almost an independent two regiment. Pretty cool. Cooper plus and placement troops, I guess. I don't know. can cost a lot of ammo and a lot of oil or metal a lot of oil 48% though alright anyway I think we have enough troops for now let's shall we pass the turn finally alright let's hope for the best Let well let's check the reports urgent issues Oh, 16 units with bad supply. Four units. Hunger, five units. Problem sending replacements to units, only 7%. Boston has high danger. Someone coming in through these areas that I don't know about? Huh, that's weird. I should probably raise a formation. A regiment of for tree. How about a brigade? MG Infantry Brigade.
<laughs> Hope we're not overdoing it with the troops, but... All right, we raised them. Okay, now... Well, can we move them? No. Let's end the turn. Let's see how it goes. Hope you guys are enjoying. Getting my water bottle here, guys. Oh, they are coming down from the top. Peacekeepers, no losses or anything. Two decisions, 96 reports. We're in a full-blown decade of fanaticism. Sirius 59 is the effect. In 14 turns, it will start diminishing. Ooh. Prospecting push. Using people outside the prospector's office, we can make much more triangulations. Cool. Recruit Merc. Nice. Two new stratagems. All right, I don't know who's pushing down here, but it can't be good. Let's see how the supply looks. Oh. Oh, terrible. Terrible. Zero food. Zero food. These guys... Oh, my goodness. That says the supplies are at 50, yet they have... Zero food. Although it says received food, so I don't know. So I don't understand. The supply numbers are up, actually. These are up. All across the board, they're up here. Which is nice to see. So it did help that we made a move there. This asset is 0.1 turn left. It's almost there. Industry 2 two turns left. Let's turn this to 50% construction. Let's see how supply is down here. Pretty good. Pretty good. Wow. We may have like uh, cracked the code a little bit. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um... These guys have AP. All right. I'm not looking at this. I'm just looking at this. Uh, we have to make replacement troops. Infantry. Machine gun. All right. Loving it. Loving it, loving it, loving it. Um... We're going to lose a lot of those towns up there, it looks like. That's okay. We'll get it back in time. Let's produce some ammunition. No, let's not. Let's not. Let's, um, yeah, now peeps can move a little bit because they're better supplied. Wow. Logistics. Love it. Let's take this militia and send them into process tunnel. Oh, there's someone there. Um, we'll see if we can identify them. Send these guys. I don't know if we'll be able to 
Maybe we should just disband that unit because it's not a big unit. Good XP on these guys though. Let's bring these 800 troopers over here to deal with that mess. 500 troopers. Industry 2 goes through, and as soon as this base is built, it's going to be very nice. Um, I want to put a supply base down there, but next turn. Training opportunity in 4th Boston Mobile Regiment. We have some training opportunities in the 4th Boston Mobile Regiment. We can either form several prospects into a specific discipline, or we can put all our, eff all our efforts into improving one prospect. What is your preference? Two intelligence experts. Yeah, let's do that. Mine plus nine. Boom. Roger that. Fourth Boston Mobile Regiment is thankful for your choice. New commander for third MG Infantry Brigade. Looks like we're going to go with Trina Bennett. She's a little bit improvisational. She's got a little ambition. Not very egoistic. Egotistic. A little corrupt. Autocracy. Uh, suitability six. Okay. Affirmative. Honored with the trust, sir. I strive to make 3rd MG Infantry Brigade the best unit around. Relation improved 18. Stratagems. Let's see here. Let's send a spy team into this area down here that's bothering us, Jerome. It's almost a guaranteed critical success. I think it might be. Yeah. Roger that. Okay, so six of them were sent in. Very nice for the nation. Uh... Send one of the mines into lower grade deposit areas. Gain reserves. Let's see. Must be played on his own with the city that has a mine. Will allow you to increase the reserves in a mine, but in exchange for a reduction in mining level. Not sure what that means, but if we look at Boston, we could play it. Prospecting push using people outside the prospectors. Let's see. Acacia Carbon 4. Acadia Carbon 4 will make the roll and it's a guaranteed success. If successful, you'll find a new resource hex. Oh. Well, that's good, but we don't really need it right now. We have a few resource hexes. Peripheral mining. Uh. Sure. Roger that. We are sending preparations in motion. You should have a decision on your desk early next round. Leaders, Shadow Spy, Investigate Leader, Units, Militant Propagandist. I'm not sure who I want to. We have a lot of militia. I don't want to give it some militia. We have independent forces. Huh. And then we have infantry. Not much. Oh yeah, we've got some.
Let's give it to this like first independent motorized MG unit. They have a scavenger team. Go and give it to them. It's the first independent motorized MG. Boom, take a militant propagandist. You to receive the precious support you allocated. They send in their gratitude. Vice, hold at hex 149.59. Remember, you made a promise to your subjects to do this. Make sure you have this hex in supply. What hex is this? 149? Oh no, we made a promise and we're gonna lose it. 149.59, this one right here. Wow, we lost a lot of those units. These free folk marauders. Hopefully everything's okay over here. Set them down in. These guys are not doing much better. And a 50. We need more spies in Mothra. Thousand troopers. Did we lose troopers in Whirlwind here? Supply uh, base is going to be open next turn. Used a lot of its fuel. Wow. These guys are going to be low on fuel too. They can stay put and they can stay put. The hunts are 1 to 15. It's 5,400 of them. These guys, if I could just combine them with a with a militia. Like these guys right here would be perfect. And we've got these guys to move. Who 
What is that money hill anyway? Yeah, I think stretch all the way down here. goes. Alright, so low on recruits, lower on ammo. Um, let's see. So logistic points. Okay, that looks decent. This was cut off pretty much. Traffic roads, traffic signs. All right, this coming down here is good. This is all good. This is gonna be good soon as that base gets built, but it, it did improve. Definitely improved since we put the traffic signs up. Um, we need something to come up this way. Wait a minute, is there a road? Yeah, there's a road from here to here. Yeah. Wow, 400, 688 through the high mountains. Um, put a road right here for 40 industrial points. Very good. Um, stratagems. Hold it, Hex. Yeah, I'm gonna lose my word about that. We're considered shifty. Yikes, we're not making believable promises. Not good. We're loved, but it's going down. Not much soldier support either. Civilization level's going up a little bit. anyone if we come out here probably just remember that's 1600 all right reports urgent issues yeah bad supply bad supply no hunger Boston saw us high danger where are all these reports cabinet overview Call the advisor, what happens? Attach? This advisor to a leader. Oh. Personnel. Factions. The circle is not as happy as they could be. they're only average power based in national government they should be higher very weak military hierarchy and no zone administration that is not good to 
And that's going to turn out bad. Resolve next round. Soldier's morale. Three rounds left on this. Current, we do not have nearly enough recon. So we're going to go down even worse in our word. Get about 50 credits per turn, a little bit less. Twenty percent zone control for the corporation, 24% for the cult. We should really meet with the cult. We could use a boost there, Mystic Temple. Roger that. Set up a small conference. Send the spy to um, Money Hill, critical success. She was unclear, but I want to make it friendly. We don't have the stuff, though, to do it. All right, so that's going to probably end this turn. Uh, one second, guys. Okay, whoa, I did not realize we're almost 50 minutes into it, guys. So, I want to say thank you so much for joining me. You guys rock and are awesome, as always. Uh, these guys down here. Um, and as always, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you did, guys, please consider dropping a like with a, a thumbs up. Because it is a big boost, not only for this video but for the series as a whole and for my channel as a whole it really helps the algorithm and all that good stuff so please consider doing that you could also leave me a comment let me know what you think i read and respond to every single one in time so please bear with me there and be patient as well and you can subscribe and hit the notification bell to not miss any of my videos dropping but uh only do any of those things if you really feel like it no pressure for me or anything like that it's all good either way so that said guys i hope to see you next time because we are you know slowly cracking the code here a bit and learning more as we go and just having a blast so hope you guys join me for next time it's gonna be fun uh going forward so i hope to see you guys then until then, be well, live well, stay well, and much love, peace, and joy. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.